Next, we move to the Meath Artisan Network event, where Taoiseach Enda Kenny is making a special appearance. This is about getting connected. It is about an expression of what is best in Meath. And I know your themes of, of women in business, digital and food speak for themselves. And it's only when you get everybody together that you actually realise the potential of what Meath has to offer. Outstanding and, and brilliant quality. And the uh, winners in the, the Bloss and Heron competition, together with Enterprise here, uh, Enterprise Week in Meath, will be the start of something very big, I have no doubt. Because you're going to get people motivated, you're going to get them incentivised, you're going to get them wanting to do better next year. Think of where you're going to be in 25 years' time. The bulge of population will be in this part of the country. So you're now preparing for the future. And isn't it a wonderful thing that the Enterprise Week here is a fledgling forerunner of what's going to happen? That there will be a buzz and enthusiasm about business, about doing business, about creation, about imaginative ways of, of uh, developing new businesses and jobs and opportunities. And I think your themes, if I may say so again, digital, Wi-Fi, uh, food, which I've seen some of the winners here this evening, and women in business, is uh, a very important troika for County Mead. But it's one that's going to be very successful. I think there are brilliant opportunities with, the, um, with all the um, facilities that are now becoming available. And I do hope that over the next half dozen years, Enterprise Week in me will have stimulated so many more come out and, and do what they do themselves. In other words, express their personality through their food or their business uh, and creative ways of doing new business. We head over now for a tour of Epicom, a major food manufacturing company based in the Navan Enterprise Centre. We've been here 15, 16 years. Uh, we were one of the first tenants here in the Enterprise Centre. Uh, since then we've built a large food business here. Uh, we do a lot of product innovation and product development and we have a lot, a lot of involvement with the different uh, technology centres like DIT and the local community in terms of uh, building uh, enterprise around food. This Meat Enterprise Week uh, is, is a huge showcase for new business, uh, for established businesses like ourselves, but also for new businesses hoping to get into the whole food sector in meat. And there's no better place than meat to, to grow a new food business. For every company, it's about talent, uh, whether it's the food industry or the IT sector, but for every company, it's about talent. And what's very important is that if you want to grow a business, you need to make sure that the talent is here and it's local. Uh, for that reason, we're always involved with schools and colleges, helping, to, helping them to, to develop their uh, interest in food. I think it, it showcases meat. It showcases what we can do. It gets people to look at what, what's possible. Um, it gets people talking to each other, people who are looking to get into business, uh, who want to see how do they get into business, people are looking to grow, how do they grow, people are looking to export, how do we export. So we, we share experiences I suppose, that's, that's the, the, the huge positivity that's going to come out of this week. Well that's all for part one, but be sure to join us at part two where we'll be attending the Women in Business event and seeing what the Business Showcase has to offer.